The second one, number two, the second reason is because of something called sunken cost theory. And what sunken cost theory is, is this idea that when you invest in something, you don't want to let go of it. And what ends up happening when you get into friend with benefits situations with guys is that a guy ends up getting all of his needs met. And so he doesn't necessarily feel like he needs to exert a lot of effort into the situation anymore because he's already getting a lot of his needs met. And so women that are in these situations where it's just kind of a fling and it's just kind of a hookup and the guy isn't doing a lot of investing, what she'll end up doing, because one of the things we talk about is like, okay, well, you're going to have to walk away from this. And if he wants to stay with you, then he'll end up coming over and being like, no, no, no. You know what? I, I, I do want a real relationship with you. Like, let's do this. But if he hasn't been investing at all, he's definitely not going to do that. <laughs> right. And even if he has been investing a lot, if he's really emotionally broken, he still probably won't do it. And so it's just, it's a bad idea from that standpoint, right? He needs to be investing a lot. He needs to be spending time, emotion, energy into investing in you so that he feels like this is a real relationship. He feels like it's something that he doesn't want to let go of. He feels like he's, he's committed to it. And that's, that's what it takes for him to feel like he's committed is for him to invest in you.